and welcome back. I am glad that you guys decided to watch my next video, which probably just came out. This is about three seconds after the last video. Since I record these in batches of three, except for our last, except for the last few ones, that was bulk recorded, like uh, that seventy explosion, of them. That building falling deep. New, new. Eddie's not going anywhere. You gave it. You're not taking Eddie from me. No more support. Yeah, no more backup. We're on our own from here. Let's use our scope to scout out the area. Doesn't look like there's any marked men. That's odd. I don't like odd. Ah! Oh. Bit of light armor. Perfect. Go down here. Cages. These look like the death claw cages from Fallout 3. Yeah, these really look like the death claw cages from Fallout 3. Ooh, riot shotgun. Mission report. Let's read this. Three war cages, captured death claws, things have escaped. Oh god, I'm gonna have to deal with death claws. Oh well. Come at me, death claws. Actually, please, no, don't. I'd really rather not deal with you. Uh -oh. Fighting over. Wait a sec, I gotta check my perks real quick.
see what's over here. Oh god! Awesome. Carol. Now I can repair Jack's outfit. Well, let's get out of here. Carton of cigarettes. Free war money. Free war money. Okay, I wanna let's go back here. Is that all? Should be. Oh, 
Whoa! Sneaking done. Fighting now. Take that, you hippie. Bad guys dealt with. Grab a couple cartons of SIGs for, uh, Niner. Since he's always out of SIGs. Some turbo. How did these nuclear warheads get all over the place? Fighting over. Like me anymore? No, but I want to wear Jack's outfit. Slight bit less DT, but I want to look stylish. I want to look stylish when, stylish when I defeat USC's. Covered.
we made it to level 30 and we got the new achievement, the boss. rescue Eddie. Eddie, my buddy, my pal. Eddie! Most of an override function piggybacked on the broadcast. Are you okay? What happened? An override frequency? Yeah! Let's go get USEs. After I loot this sentry bot. And this box. What? Don't look at me like that, Eddie. I'm a guy and I have needs. One of those needs is to loot everything. Unlock that please, Eddie. Thank you. Access commissary. Dr. Physical Exam. Let's be wielding something classy when we go up. 
to meet him. Flashbang grenades, do not need those. Salt carbine, what can I repair this with? Dinner bell's classy. Nothing classier than a shotgun, right? That's an American flag. And this... This is a silo full of missiles. Even in this place, NCRs, judging by... Either way. I still don't understand. You've answered your own question. You... And you brought... No. Many messages can be taken. Let me answer for this. Blame you. Not others. No. Learn. You showed me a road, a way to carry my message. You've already answered for what you've done. Now the flag you follow will answer for it. So, you intend to bomb the Mojave? No, not the Mojave. The West. All that's been built since America died. Same symbols as before the war. Now a flag carried by a tribe of children. You walked, and after... Can't destroy the West? <laughs> Even no with all the missiles to here. destroy the bear. You taught me that. I'll turn the... You may not Words believe in nations, are not I do. enough to bear the weight of your flag. Speeches are th I need to know why you're doing this. Not for my sake, for history's sake. The why of it. You taught me the why of it. If you believe in something enough, you must be willing to let it burn, lest it claim you. These governments of the two-headed bear, the Legion, they carry old world ideas into an age that no longer needs them, where they cannot live. I'm not talking about NCR Legion, I'm talking about our history. Our history. The divide. That history has been written. It's lessons learned. There's nothing more to be dug from these cracks in the earth. No more fury to be torn from its sky. You can go home again, Courier. Not a message for me. For you. My home in the East, Drywells, is no more. It is part of the Legion. The only op- One courier built a community. Seems that you can do the same. There is truth, but Mojave's proof. Whatever. The divide survived in you. If it felt like something fighting for, you can rebuild it. Nothing can prevent what comes. The missiles will launch. These questions. Your words or mine, what do they matter to you? Even if the missiles launch and I die here, I can if I can convince you, that's enough for me. It is enough. It may be that as much destruction has been written in the earth here, you may build something else as you built the divide. You have spoken truly. There is a shadow of a nation behind you, the hope of a people, yet it may not matter. The Divide still stands against us. The Divide? What do you mean? No. We've already handled everything it can throw at us. Our enemies gather outside, shadows of the bear and a bull. They will have found their way in, just as you did. It was always my intention. In case I could not kill you, the marked men would flood this place, cut off your escape. If we cannot prevent... The 
Come on, Eddie. Ah, what the hell? First aid kit. Alright, an auto inject stim pack. I can do this. Shoot! This is madness. Watch the floor. Activate missile launch terminal. Attempt to cancel the launch. Ask Eddie for help. Experiment Eddie. log three six nine two four. Initial tap. More heavily protected systems are still problematic. Military grade encrypt. We've stopped tests before any robots were destroyed. No, Eddie. I don't care. NCR and Caesar's Legion. Dumb USEs. We must run. The divide erupted in fire, violent, red, as the last message of the two couriers arced into the sky. The missiles rained like spears down on the land, burning flags and communities alike, destroying all they struck. The history of the West was erased for the second time, thorough and complete, and America slept once more.
Hopeville burned lightless in the night. So then, Invisible fires we have just launched missiles. Scorching it from within and without. It is said a man still walked its streets with a tattered jacket and old world flag etched on the back. He remained there, perhaps as punishment for the scars he left on the wastes, or a reminder of a history he could not forget. For Ulysses, his journey was over. The courier had been the end of his road. As for the courier, he turned his back on his home for the second time and made his way back, navigating the treachery of the Divide. Tunnelers and the marked men avoided the lone figure, as if recognizing the courier's right to passage, or out of fear. The courier walked until he stood again upon the edge of the Divide, the last road he would walk before the second battle for Hoover Dam. There, beside his feet, was a final package from one courier to another. A footlocker bearing a gift and a message. But that message, it is something for couriers to carry and for them alone. The lights flickered across the divide. Reminders that the old world histories persist and find meaning in the present. It said, war, war never changes. Men do through the roads they walk. And this road has reached its end. And so, has this episode. But before we go, I'm going to give you all a little bit of a recap. We just launched nuclear missiles against both the NCR and Caesar's Legion. They will both hate us now. Which is all well and good. Because we're doing the Yes Man ending. Thank you.